Hey everybody, welcome back to another episode of Night Witches. So today I've got a treat for you guys. We got the Mauler outfitted. It's been about a month and a half in-game time of getting mechs repaired and back into uh, uh, systems ready. So the Blood Asp is back. The Timberwolf is back. I didn't, <coughs> excuse me, I didn't do any changes on Timberwolf. Blood Asp slightly changed. Um, we have a quick look here. The LRM stayed in place, but we had a triple plus ex or a double plus exchanger in here, which was three tons, and I just replaced it with a normal one, and I had to get some heat sinking in, so I actually bought an e-cooling system plus three and dropped that in um, just to drop our heat. We got much better heat sinking now on this guy, so we're only three off, which is really, really good. We lost a half a ton of LK ammo, which is no big deal because I just basically um, pull out a half a ton of swarm ammo and put in a full ton of swarm. So it kind of equals out. So now we have we have uh, four tons of swarm ammo, which is great. I prefer using that anyway. Um, it's much harder hitting. We get somebody out in the open with a warlord. We're hitting for seven each with these things. So that's great. Uh, okay. So that being said, let's go back here. Um, I outfitted the mauler. Now I went back and forth on how I was going to build this guy. Um, I like the fact that it's got six energy hard points, three in each arm. And it, you know, and it's got two uh, ballistic and two missile hard points, one in each torso. I tried to go with an ultra ten build just to manage the heat because I've only I was going to put a prototype double heatsink kit in it, and I only got two prototype double heatsinks. So an energy build really was out of the question with this mech. Now it does have a lot of space. So I could have put just regular double heatsinks in, but then it would have just been all energy and full of double heatsinks, and I I didn't really want to go that way. So I tried to double. I tried to do a double AC10 build, like Ultra AC10, and I had the SM9 in and an ATM9, and then you know the heat sinking was good at that point. And then as soon as I tried to put anything energy in the arms, it just went completely out of whack. And I was like, okay, well, what are we going to do to make this guy like relatively viable on the battlefield? Because I was trying to go for a mid-range brawler mech and try to keep all my weapons mid-range, hence the uh, Ultra Tens and the. Um, the ATM and the SM9, it's all mid-range, mid -range, about 600 meters, right? And then I thought, well, if we're going to do it, we might as well do it. And this guy is going to be a heavy hitter. So let's have a look at this guy. And, whoops, we're on the wrong one. I was staring at the mech and here, but I didn't click on him properly. So let's uh, have a look here. Um... Yeah, so I figured we'd go with a pair of Ultra 20s with the large improved heavy laser in the arm. And I maxed out pretty much everything. I upgraded the engine from a 270 to a 280 just so that I could get a plus one heat sinking in here so we can get an e-cooling plus one in here. The heat efficiency is actually not that bad. I mean, we won't be firing the large improved heavy all of the time. Um, but enough that we need some pretty good heat sinking, which was why we have the heat bank in here. I didn't have an exchanger to add, so... You know, I couldn't do that. But we do have the fire control system advanced um, clan, which means we have breaching shots. So I can split up the AC-20 fire, uh, Ultra-20 fire on two different mechs, and it will do full damage. And then if we want to go with the large improved, we can put that on a third mech, right, for 90 damage up close. And since this guy is, like, you know, uh, relatively in close brawler, we, I mean, we've got the uh, fire control system advanced, which gives us plus 10% to all range brackets, and then the TTS weapons, which gives us another 20% increase to range brackets so our ac ultra 20s will be hitting just a little over 400 meters 450 meters somewhere around there um which is great you know and then we've got a nova cws to hide until we get into battle and a supercharger to get us in really fast right so the speed really isn't that great um it's a 4.7 build not really that fast but the supercharger should get us into to closer ranges quicker to be able to do a half decent amount of damage now it is increased heat when activated which means we'll probably lose uh lose the ability to use the large improved heavy laser but that's fine i don't mind and then we have this arm cleat completely clear so this is our shield side so we're just going to turn our left side to the enemy and shield ourselves um from damage hopefully using that side now um i think it's a pretty good build i got the heat dissipating armor in because i had to um just to get the heat level down, but the repair costs are going to go up, uh, and that's fine. I'm okay with that. So, yeah, that's how this guy is going to work out. So, let's get into a battle here today. Actually, you know what? Let's get to, you got to do it this way. All right. So, the battle I got planned, um, I wanted to make sure the Mauler was back for it because it's, a, it's going to be a good one. Now, we jumped systems. Uh, let's have a quick look at the star map. I was going to move into Ghost Bear territory. 
And then I thought, well, we need to make a stop here so I can sell stuff, right? Just so I can get the uh, mauler up and going. Because once I put the Klein XL engine in uh, and a few other components, I was already like over like three and a half million C bills. Like, what's like, you know, it was just ridiculous the cost, right? So we jumped here. We were, was it here? No, we were here, I think. Yeah, Honda. And we jumped over here. We were, I was on my way to here, but I figured we'll just jump here first. But we got a lot of missions we can actually do on this planet, which is great. So let's have a look at the contracts real quick. So the one I want to do today, we've got a bunch here. Um, I've had a look. We've got a lot of missions we can take here. Now, there is Howl of the Beast 2, which I'm going to stay away from. I don't know if we're ready for a Ragzilla with these guys. But uh, the Hostile Insertion mission here, I think, is probably a pretty good one. Uh, there's a heavy lance uh, inserted on the surface by Ghost Bear. So we're going to go and hit these guys up and give this Mauler a whirl. So let's negotiate this. And we're going to go full salvage and accept. And let's pull out the second lance. And bring in our max. So the, the Basilisk will stay... Sorry, I keep calling it Basilisk. The Blood Asp... I see this and I think Basilisk. The Blood Asp will stay with uh, Baba Yaga and then the Mauler and then we're going to go with our standard Grasshopper and Black Knight to shred these guys. So let's bring Baba Yaga in here. Uh, Sunflower and Hot Dam and Megasaur. And I think we're ready to go. I'm thinking Sunflower is really going to enjoy this mech. I'm hoping she blasts the crap out of these guys. So let's deploy and get this done. Okay, this has been a while since we've been on this map. All right, well, yeah. Receiving you. No sense putting off the inevitable. No shooting, just running. Oh, we're gonna have running in a second. All right, we got to kill these guys on this side fast. I got a feeling they're gonna have. Um, they're going to have reinforcements coming from this side. Failed to connect. Got that feeling. Commander? Let's get up here, girl. Let's not block Megasaur, though. Get in the trees just in case they shoot at you. You are kind of light in the 70 tons there. Um, let's close the gap. I love the fact that the uh, LRMs are... Uh, have no minimum range in the clans. Let's get the mauler up to sprintable distance. I can't wait to see what this thing does at point blank range. I've got eyes on hostile reinforcements. They're heading your way. Of course you do. Arctic Wolf, forty tons. I almost don't want to waste my uh, AC-20 ammo on that thing. Night gear. Well, there's the first target for the uh, Black Knight. Unless something heavier comes up. Mm-hmm. Demos. Well, that's our target. Mm hmm Executioner, okay. Waiting for orders. We gotta remove these guys fast, so let's go ahead and do that. Let's get some eyes on. And let's shut this guy down. Um, yeah, we're going to go with Inferno. I'm going to hit them with a tag as well, just in case. Okay, he's shut down. Which means he's dead. Um, no, we're going to reserve you. I don't want you to block in Sunflower. Now, um, 
interested to see how far we can go with the supercharger run. That's actually pretty damn nasty for a, uh, that's pretty damn nasty for something with a pair of, okay. pair of Ultra 20s. 43, huh? Twenty-five, seventy-four, and then on the Arctic Wolf. God, you're gonna die horribly. I'm saving you for Megasaur, so even though we got good chances to hit, let's wreck this guy. I'm gonna leave the large improved ox. I don't think we're gonna need it for this guy. Um, and we're just gonna fire. Mel is still alive. Don't have much left though. Let's exchange some missile fire. I don't know what that night gear is gonna be like, but I think we go after. We could thunder this guy. Oh, I think we go this way. Elite Gladiator, eh? Yeah. Let's do it. Strip some of that armor off. Standing by. Supercharger, please. We don't have melee ability on this guy? Really? You're joking. Oh, now we do. Okay, here we go. Um, gonna go from this side. Flail on. Um, yeah. Here it comes, folks. Enjoy it. Yeah, we got his arm first. It's alright, the guy's not moving this turn, so... Uh, no, you need to reserve, because I want Hot Dam to spot that night gear. You're going to change to the night gear. I want you to change to the night gear. Because that guy's own, he all he can do is power up this turn. Once he powers up, he's still going to be shredded. Well, the night gear is making a break for it. All right. Um... Sure, you just make your break for it, and, uh, yeah. Let's get into here. See if we can finish up both of these guys. We're going to multi against him and him. Um, just going to go this route. Not enough. we got a knockdown, though, which is good. All right, let's finish up this side. Moving out. Okay, I gotta remember to shut off the mask and supercharger next turn. Um, did I not take any damage there? Um, yeah, let's go this route. I want this guy gone. So let's go from behind. Hopefully we get a CT hit on him. Let's finish him up. Thank you. Enemy down. Yes, Commander. Um. Double kill for me, girl. You double kill these guys, please and thank you. Breaching shot. Oh, that guy's still going. Woo. Took it in the face and he's still going. Good job, buddy. I mean, you're not going to be doing much this turn, but... Oh, he's almost gone, though. Man, they love the blood asp. 
Don't know why that is. I can't, I can't see how four LRM-20s are that much of a threat to uh, the enemy. Let's get into here. Um, I'm going to switch up the ammo. I'm going to save the swarm for later. We're just going to put some LK on this guy. Let's hammer him. Yep. See ya! That's probably why they're shooting at him. Look at the numbers still coming up. Wow, nice shooting, man. I mean, you're against the Mahler. It's not going to do much, but still. Good targeting. Oh, you're heated. Too bad I can't get over there. Look at this. It looks like Megasaur and, and uh, Hot Dammer around a campfire over there. Okay, let's get uh, this off so we don't fail it. Sprint down here. Okay, looks like we got some more eyes on. We got a Marauder, another Exterminator. This is not an Executioner. Let's warm ourselves up here. Yes, Amazon. Yeah, I gotta say that 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 pair up of um, the flamer mech and the melee mech is actually a pretty darn potent uh, combination. As long as you remember to turn the mask and the uh, supercharger off, you know everything's good. Uh, let's keep and get the tag on him. Nope, wasn't expecting it, but that's fine. Now you need to turn yours off as well. Just so that we can use it more when we get closer. Now, what is this guy? Marauder. Um, we need to close. So we're going to move in and we're going to swap these around. Oh, we don't have to turn these off. We got 19 turns of fire and left. I toyed with put, putting a couple of large lasers in this thing, but I'm thinking if we're going to be point blank, the large improved or the uh, heavy improved laser is just such such a better. Oh, venerable Bishop Steiner, eh? It's such a better um, loadout to be using. Um, I think we need to sprint. Let's get in the valley here, so they can't get a direct line of sight on us. And we got the. Dire Wolf, Lone Wolf, Venerable Bishop Steiner. It's all going to be 20. Doesn't really matter who we go against. Let's go against this guy. We can do a fair bit of damage to that guy. Okay, we're going to reserve Megasaur. I want Hot Damn to go first. See if we can get eyes on. That night gear might be backing up though. Nope, he's not. That's fine, man. You do you, and I'll do me. And let me show you who's is better. Ba -down, ba -down, down. Here comes the six million dollar grasshopper. Oh, maybe not. Ha! <laughs> oh. Let's get that mask on. Eyes on, please. Oh, yeah. See if we can shut him down. Probably not, but uh, let's leave the fluid gun off for now. And I'm going to switch this up to acid, just so that if we hit with one, we know Megasaur is going to kill this guy. Yeah, there's the hit. And we shut him down. He's in a lot of trouble. Hopefully Megasaur has got the range. I'm not sure she does. Thanks for coming out. Hmm. Let's use the hill as cover. Copy that. Um, we're just gonna fire the large improved. 
It's not going to cost us any heat. Let's shoot for the arm. Maybe we blow it off. No, but good damage. That way, if Megasaur hits the arm, we'll take it right off. I want her on this lone wolf, though. Waiting for orders. Super duper charger. Yeah, we don't have the uh, just shy of range here. This is who? The Marauder. Okay, I think we're okay here. Uh, I'm going to Vigilance. Just so we can get out of here quickly. And I think the Flail's out of range too, isn't it? Yeah. That's fine. We'll just keep our, uh, keep our heat level up. Wow. One or the other, eh? Let's stay a little warmer. See if we can pull this arm off. Thank you. Yeah. Yeah, we'll be dropping that in a minute. Yes, Commander. Um. I have no idea what is up with these guys. So I gotta be careful here. Let's go after the torso. I want to get them within range here. Come on, guys. Move forward. Right into my trap. Right into my trap. Come on. There you go. There you go. Shooting at the wrong person, but there you go. Whoop. We gotta kill that guy. Reporting critical hit. I saw that crit. We got to go after that guy. Can we get a direct line of sight on that BBS? We can. We get a better line of sight? I don't think so. Okay. Swarming it up. We got four turns of swarm left. We're loading this. Let's hit this venerable Bishop Steiner. Wow. Terrible chances to hit, but we gotta shoot him. Spread it around. Mauler's in range to damage the crap out of that guy, though. Light damage. Holding firm. Standing by. Your mask is on, right? It is. Can't get close enough. Confirm. Taking a shot. Okay, that guy's out of the battle. And we're gonna move Sunflower in for the kill in that Bishop Steiner. Although we should probably hammer this lone wolf. Mm. I think the Steiner is da more dangerous than the uh, lone wolf. Supercharger on. God damn, we can't shoot him. How can we not shoot him? Well, we're vigilance. Let's get into here. He's not. He's not out of range. Damn it! I 
Let's hammer this guy. I thought about splitting fire, but I think if we can focus one guy down, we can get him out of the battle here. The extra 40 points wouldn't have made that much difference. Especially if I would have missed. Great, now we're in fire. Okay. We need to give them more targets so the uh, blood ass can need to move out. Come on, you guys. Figure out what you're doing. Hate the fact that Megasaur still goes before them. Or still goes before Hot Dam. She needs to reserve. I could kill this guy, but he's not a threat at the moment. I really need her on somebody up ahead. Um, ooh, okay. Let's um, do this again. We really need to kill this venerable Bishop Steiner, man. Full speed. No target. Oh, we don't have eyes on them, really? Not worried about that. We got Warlord. Wow, we're still overheated even with Warlord? Really? Man. I don't know. 63. Why is it only 7? Uh, it's probably got... Um, yeah. Well, can't multi now. Inflicted some heavy damage. He's going down. Yeah, and unfortunately, our mask is still on, isn't it? Sure is. Got to turn it off now. Moving at full throttle. Let's just keep this guy shut down. Our supercharge is on, isn't it? It is on. 5% chance of failure. We don't have the range to get that. Uh... Guy, but we do have the range to get in. Oh, that's figures at 5%? <sighs> really? At five freaking percent. Confirmed. At five percent. Negative damage. Repeat negative damage. You know, I gotta just assume that it's gonna fail. At least we got a shit ton of uh oh, you're gonna make a mistake and try and melee? What? The hell? What is going on? They're like, Megasaur must be removed from the game. Let us go ahead and do that now. Hammer him. Yeah, figures. Well, the Muller can take that. That Direwolf's not going to be able to take four all, 
four AC20 and a uh, thing in the back, though, I don't think. Five per you know, I've been so diligent. I'm watching my supercharger, my mask, and it just screws me anyway. You're still standing. Don't fall over. Megasaur goes on 23. Oh, you're going to try and knock her down. You're all within... Damn it! They're all within death range. When she gets up, she's going to be pissed off. You can leave that guy for a turn. Okay, B needs the acid. And hopefully the tag. Don't think we're going to shut this guy down, but add a bit of heat to him. Okay, we got acid on. Perfect. Okay, this guy's gone. This guy hasn't gone. Steiner's got to go. VBS has got to go. Walk it over here. I think we make sure he dies. That problem solved. Marauder hasn't gone yet. Let's hammer this guy. Is he going down? Enemy mech. Critical damage detected. Battle mech power up detected. Damn it. Well, we tried our best. Okay. Yes, 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 yes. I lost two swarm ammo. I don't think I have any way to replace that. Megasaur is going to get up and wreck this guy now, though. They're flanking. Yeah. He don't got much to flank with, though. Standing by. You just pissed her off. It's all you're doing. It's all you're doing. All you doing is pissing her off. Hey, guess what's back, guys? Freaking Berserker. Here comes 776 damage in the back. You want to play the games? Here we here we can play some games. Oh my god, you missed! <laughs> Are you serious? What is going on? What is going on? <laughs> Oh. What is going on? My God. <sighs> Watch, it'll be the night gear now. I think it's going to be the exterminator. Oh, the exterminator goes on 25, so it's probably going first. Hot damn's got to shut somebody down. If we can shut down that dire wolf, I'll do that. I don't think this guy's that much of a threat anymore. Of course, that being said, I think the night the uh, dire wolf's the big threat. So we're gonna move her down into here. Oh, what did he do that for? Waiting for orders. Do I have my mask on? I think I turned it off. Did I not? It's off. Okay, let's get that back on again. Get right in here. I don't care. Watch my heat. Yeah, you're fine. We've got Warlord up. Oh my god, maybe not. SRM can come off. Wow, that's a lot of heat. Uh, let's risk it for the biscuit, guys. I'm going to vigilance her. Let's get this guy. 
77. Keep an eye on my heat, Commander. Yeah, I'm watching it. Orders. Just do it. Get rid of them. 97%. Thank you. Couldn't do it when you had double damage, huh? That's a kill. Sure as hell is. Jammed by UCM. That's fine. F this night gear. Oh, we lost an arm. I did not see that. I did not see the fact that we lost an arm. Standing by. I saw the ammo loss. See ya. Yeah, I'm liking the Muller loaded. I gotta say, with that coupled with that supercharger, it makes a huge difference. Now we all have to do is go buy another supercharger for Megasaur because we don't have any. I had to buy the one I put in the Muller. Where are you going? Doesn't matter where you go, you're gonna die. Come on, buddy. Man, our supercharger broke with 5%, then the venerable Bishop Steiner headbutts us, and then we miss a friggin' 776 damage melee attack from behind a mech. Boom, boom, boom. Well, somebody said bad luck always comes in threes. I don't know who it was, but. Somebody said it. I don't believe that BS, but whatever. Um, My heat gauge is getting pretty high. Yeah, I know. Ready for orders. We're hoping to end this, though. We're hoping to end this right here. Engaging. There we go. There it is, folks. That was a close one. I think it's time for a Blood Ash refit. That's what I think. I think with these three close range mechs, we're going to need another one that's going to be another close range brawler. We lost a weapon mount. We lost a lot of stuff off this guy. So I'm thinking maybe we leave a pair of LRM-20s in and go with something else. I don't know. We'll have to. We'll see. I don't think the Blood Ash is working for me at the moment, but we'll see. Pretty good. The Mauler got three kills. Got three kills. It better have with the double H Ultra 20s. Okay, let's grab Direwolf part. Um, can we complete any mechs? Venerable Bishop Steiner part. <sighs> Come on, is there a supercharger down here? Couldn't get that lucky, I don't think. Heat Bank Clan, that's a nice thing. We need exchangers too. Right of exchangers. Masks we got. Up, oh, there's a weapon mount. <clears throat> Excuse me. We don't have upper recoils. We have upper energy mounts. Hmm. What do we take for number three? On the Mauler, the uh, Ultra Twenties are in the torsos, which is if I would if. If they weren't, I definitely would have taken the uh, the two upper um, ballistic recoil reduction. Let's grab that. It's much better heat dissipating. This can get swapped out for the one, the inner sphere one that we have in the Mauler right now. That extra minus five or it actually minus four heat per turn. The overheat's a little less, but the minus four heat per turn will help out. Either that or it'll, or it'll end up going in the um, the blood asp. Let's go this route. All right, Demios part, or Demos uh, executioner part, exterminator part, night gear part. Man, it was the streaks that I sold before. I was talking about selling for lots of stuff for lots of money on uh, Jade Falcon Freeborn. It's the streaks that are worth so much. Like if you get a pack of streaks, it just 
I think it was like 220,000 per streak six or something. And I had like 10 of them or something. The clan versions just sold them. They were just, they just went like hotcakes, made lots of money. Anyway, that's a pretty good, that's a pretty good uh, haul there. All right. 380,000. Yeah, well, we knew it was going to be expensive. But we got some stuff we can sell, which we need for our financial report. Um, all right, let's have a look at another uh, mission here. We've got how many days? 30. Well, I got 30 days of the financial report, so we're pretty good here. Uh, let's find something relatively quick. Incomplete intelligence. Destroy a base? Three skulls? Second Lance should easily be able to do that. What about settling a grudge, though? Planetary government? Yeah, four and a half. I think we're probably okay doing that. Something a little bit more challenging, I think. So, okay. Um, let's bring Orion. Um, Cataphract. Hellbringer. Now, do we want to bring the Defiance? Rack 5 and a pair of PPCs. Let's go all firepower with this one. Not sure what we're going to expect here. Uh, Sound Sonic. Where are you here? Chupi and Diva. Let's do this. All right. What a glorious spot for my combat. Ah, maybe I should have brought the archer. I'm here. How much I can really do now? Up for what Let's worth. get up this hill before they get too much of a height advantage on us. Waiting on you, Commander. Oh, we're waiting on you. See if we can stay in the trees here. Good to go. Don't think we can get everybody in the trees though. Ready for orders. Nope. Pretty darn close. These guys are, you know, pretty fast for a heavy lance. Ready for orders. Understood. Moving fast. Heads up, Commander. You've got hostile contacts inbound. Always got hostile contacts inbound. Uh-huh. I could get behind this rock and then just kill those guys. Exterminator, what do we have over here? I can't pan the camera right now. Nah, they're gonna be lerming us to death. Let's just get in there. What do we got over here? Catapult, okay. Hey. Nothing so glorious like speed of sound, Sonic. Okay, who do we got back here? Thunderbolt. Another Thunderbolt. Okay. This is going to be a good battle. Let's use the LK. Get better chance to hit. I'm going to fire. Use your ATMs. I'll use my SRMs. But the same damage, roughly. Yeah, Commander. Um... How do we want to play this? Let's get up in here. On my way. Double time. Oh, what do we got over here? Galahad. Okay. Black cat. Nice. Get some parts from a black cat and another ghost. All right, we got sights on the catapult. I'm only gonna fire three rounds with the rack. Ah, one hit. Hopefully that Galahad won't move and I'll be able to wreck it. Well, too late. <laughs> Light, feet, light uh, Goss Rifles aren't going to get you anywhere here, buddy. They're not going to get you anywhere in this battle. Alright, just firing. Okay, we've got a tag on. Good to go. There was a good clear shot here. Moving Let's take on. the clear shot. Um, what do we got chance to hit? Oh my god. Oh, shoot. This is, doesn't have double racks. I keep thinking about, uh, yeah. Never mind. 
Yeah, normal. Uh, I'm not going to bother warlording it. We don't need to at this point. But maybe we should pinpoint... Uh, now let's just shoot him. I think we'll be able to burrow through this side. There we go. Yeah. He's only 60 tons. We'll just burrow through the side. I'll save that for the warlord from when we need it. Ooh. That's a fair bit of sixes. Easy on the armor, buddy. Light damage. All right, what the hell else do they have back there? Jorman Gundir, of course. What else would it be? And he gets to go again. Because of course he does. <sighs> oh no, that was the, probably the catapult. Nope. That was the army. Okay, you can cut it out now. What's this guy again? Thunderbolt? 38, eh? Forty-four. That guy on the ground, the Galahad's gonna die. So let's turn our face this way to get that splash damage across the front, I think. Okay. Alright, um... Time for a little bit of Warlord. And hammer him! Hopefully he won't go before we get a chance to knock him over. Uh, the Thunderbolt's going. Nope. Oh, who's that? Oh, that's the black cat, probably. Maybe it's got a Clan XL. Wow, you got flamers? Ooh, instability is not good. Stability is not good. I thought this was going to be a fast battle. How mistaken I was. Wow, that other thunderbolt goes too. I think that sh I think that she's going to go down. That's not good. If this thunderbolt doesn't get her. Oh, okay. Minor damage, commander. I think that was a thunderbolt. Who was that? Yeah, it was. Okay. No, it wasn't a Thunderbolt. Shit. Screw you. What's up, boss? Okay. Let's see if we can get this guy out of here. Really? That hit something good. You... Oh yes, my god. Commander. Such good chances to hit and you just gave it away. Heading out. Just try and kill this guy, please. Target 
Come on. Gotta be kidding me, guys. Losing armor. The only reason why I moved over there is to pull the heat off of um, Speed of Sound Sonic. Because if that Yormi decides to shoot at her, he's gonna, she's going to go down. That'll be bad for next turn. No! Okay, good. Good, 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 good. Now we can fade back. Nice, good distraction there. Just walk it up. Get our stability back. Let's finish this guy off. Uh, let's burrow through the torso. Uh, yes. Not a finish, but that's fine. He's horribly mangled, though. Are we close to the CT? It's completely unstable, though. Yeah, we're pretty close to killing the CT. Okay, we need to fade back now. Speed of Sound Sonic's got to retreat. She's going to come back here. If she can get ahead of these guys, that is. I'm going to be pissed if she goes down. Ah, oh, shit. Really? Critical hit. Bad one, I think. Yeah, really bad. Oh, wow, the Thunderbolt goes on 22. What does this guy go on? I have no idea. I'm in here. Yeah, well, it's your turn. Yeah, we're not going to use all of these, obviously. Wow, we can only use one. Really? That's fine, dead fire it. We made him unsteady. We should have had two of these guys dead by now. <sighs> Come on, what are you doing, buddy? Move it or lose it. Okay. Stay unstable. Works for me. Even with him being unstable, we got this shitty a chance to hit, really? Okay. Commander? Stay in the trees, please. Right, Commander. Finish this guy up, please. It is, for now. Okay, that's the crapapult. Uh, 
That's the army, probably. Hey, knock it off. No, this is the army. He's gonna end up killing us all if we don't uh, eliminate these guys in here. Position confirmed. Got to go full rack on this guy. Let's hope for some uh, damage somewhere. Okay, we open something up. He's unstable. His arm. I'm healed. Oh, I thought we had a supercharger. Couldn't get that lucky. What's up, dude? Shit. They don't like her. How do we do here? Not very well. Wow. We got to get rid of this far thunderbolt first. He's got to go. So they get eyes off and we can stay at the distance. They're just going to do too much damage to us before we get a chance to do that, though. We may have to pull out soon. This is costing us sea bills we don't really have at the moment. Although I do have three catapults and storage I can sell. Okay, he's on fire. We'll take that arm off in a second. Well, we don't have to. He did it for us. Oh, he took the other arm off. Commander, I'm hit. Yeah, I see that. We're all hit. Alright, do as much damage we can to the side. Firing everything I've got. Nice. Oh, yeah, baby! Waiting for orders. You got that right. Alright, we need to do this now. Because we got to take this guy's apart here. Let's pull this guy's side off. Target. We didn't get his arm, eh? Must have hit him in the torso. We did. Almost got the torso though. Damn it. They can still see us. I was hoping to kill that guy. I'm taking internal damage. Well oh, no. no 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 no. Receiving you. Finish him up, please. He's gotta go. Oh, we don't need vigilance on this one. Uh, we don't need an OP either. Um, four shots. Firing. Inflicted some heavy damage. I don't think he's got any weapons left. He might have. Somehow still see us. He's got one launcher left. Probably LRM 10 or 15 or something. Losing lots of armor. Okay. 
Okay, I think we've got this side stabilized. Can we fire a maneuver? We can. And yes. Got to make sure. And let's back up. Mm, I could go in those trees, but chances are they're going to catch fire next turn, so... Um, let's brace it. Let's take a turn to figure out what we're going to do here. Oh, they can still see us. And the AC5, the rack's gone anyway. That your army's gonna kill us. Your army's gonna kill us. That's the ghost. Can't hit him yet, but got to cool off anyway. Commander? Location confirmed. Well, I don't know, maybe we just pull out. If we can't see the Yormi, and he's firing at us, even if we push forward, we still have three other mechs to deal with. So that was the ghost. There's the black hat. Catapults. I'm doomed. We're all doomed. What are you talking about? You're doomed. Uh, we need to turn the right side. On my way. Commander? Affirmative. I don't know how we're going to get eyes on here. Though without completely exposing ourselves. Full speed, no target. Yeah, we got to go. Hey, I lost a weapon. Yeah. Even if we came in with the archer, it wouldn't have mattered. Alright, we're retrying. It's costing us too much. Time to go. Yeah, I'm not sure how else we could... I mean, I guess if we had pushed up the right side, but the Yorman gun deer, as long as you can see us, it's or we have it has sensors on, it's going to hit us. We lost components, but we didn't lose any arms or legs or anything, so I take that as kind of a win, but still. I don't know. That was a tough one. We got one piece of salvage. Let's find something that we can... Hopefully that we lost. Prototype double heatsink is a, probably a really good choice. And yes, we didn't... Let's just take one of these guys. Can't get any components back that we lost, but whatever. Alright, we only got one of them. Two exterminator parts. Yeah. Well... 460,000. Oh, that's not as bad as I thought it was going to be. 60 days for repairs, man. Well, that was a four and a half skull. That was a tough one. 
for what we had there. Let's manage our tasks a little better here. So what can we get back early enough to have a lance to go with? Uh, okay, definitely want the grasshopper back. If we can get that back earlier. The blood asp was only seven days. And we can change some stuff up around on her. The mauler, let's get that to the top. That was a really good uh, run for that mech. So let's bring that in. Uh, grasshopper up. Blood asp up. Actually, leave the blood ash there. Hellbringer, I don't know. Uh, Rotter's still at 14 days. Catapult's still 10. Um, bring the Black Knight up. Get the main lance ready to go, I think. So let's bring her in here. So 8 days. 17 days the Hellbringer will be back. Then who else do we want up here? Something like that, I think. Let's get the Marauder up, up sooner. Do I want the... Def I think I... W I don't know. Let's go this route. The Orion's easier to fix. We only lost a large pulse, so I think we can probably just refit that quickly. So let's go that route. It's going to be quite a number of days before we get stuff back, but uh, we've got 30 days to the financial report, so I think we'll be okay. We have 134000 left in the bank. We've got some stuff we can sell, so I'm not worried about that. Um, but there are still several missions here we can take. Let's have a look here. Yeah, I mean, there's some lower ones we could take if we wanted to. Uh, Black Hand. Um, Pride and Vanity is against uh, Clan Ghost Bear as well. Battle in the Jungle. Uh, which we can do with the main lance. Uh, I don't think I want to go coupe. Maybe, maybe not. I don't know. Broken Chain. This is against Karita. It's a destroy base. We might do it. Maybe not. Assassinate mission. That's more of a main lance thing. Incomplete intelligence. This could be easily... Well, that's Ghost Bear. So secondary lance could easily do that one. And this one is against planetary government. So we still got a few more we can do here. Uh, so we'll stay around and um, get these mechs repaired up in between episodes. I did uh, up, did uh, upgrade the uh, machinist shop in the Argo. We, I didn't do uh, full upgrades on the Argo for this series, unfortunately. This was the last um, mech bay upgrade. It only gave us plus one uh, tech boost. I was trying to get the Mauler back before the end of the month. It was 11 days, and the end of the month financial report was 11 days. So I, I, I bought this. didn't really matter. But then I also hired another pilot that had uh, plus one tech points, which didn't matter. So, you know, whatever. Anyway, I'm going to leave the episode there, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, drop a like. If you haven't subscribed, please feel free to subscribe. And you can drop any comments in the comment section down below. Until next time, we'll see you all later.